Today I'm going to be sharing how I make $200 to $400 from um, just home working on the computer. Um, I don't sell anything just because um, I really haven't found anything that I would really um, be good at selling and um, I'm not really comfortable with uh, selling products. So um, for now this is what I do and um, sorry my dog was whining. <laughs> I didn't want to do the whole video with him whining. It's, it's really rainy outside today so they had to dry off in the garage and everything like that before they could come in. Okay, so back to what I was saying. Um, I make typically um, more than 200, but um, you could probably make more. Um, it's just kind of like, I don't want to be doing this when my husband's home or when my baby's awake. So what I do is I get up early in the morning and do it. Um, that just works best for me, but I guess if you feel comfortable doing it while your child is awake and they let you, then go for it. So the two main websites that I use are gotranscript.com and babbletype. With gotranscript.com, I can typically make around $7 a day. I know that doesn't sound a lot, but like a lot, but it's... Um, 7 times 5 is 35, right? So, I mean, it does add up. I only do it 5 days a week, so I can make $35 with that. And then, um, with Babbeltype, I can make more. There's always more work on there. So, I can usually make, um, like, $20 a day if I, if I worked really hard at it, or, or 10 So, um, my goal is around $15 a day. Um, that just sets me up to make more than that 200 and um, I'll link everything below um, I really like these uh, these websites um, I use the money for bills we use the money to go on dates um, just stuff like that you know um, it is not a full-time job it's definitely not so this is not something that you can quit your job to do if you're uh, a working mom but um, you know if you're a stay-at-home mom already and you're just looking to make some extra income without uh, selling without having to pay for you know a, uh, I really want to do Scentsy but what's stopping me is that $120 uh, startup you know the startup kit but eventually, you know, I'll probably do that just because it sounds fun and I love Sensi or whatever. But um, for now, this is this is what I do and I really, really encourage you to check it out. Um, it's really helped us and, and, and I like it. I like transcribing. Um, transcribing, I guess I should tell you what you do. Um, you just uh, choose the work and then um, you convert an audio file into text. So you listen to an audio file, I just put in my earplugs, in my earphones, and I just type away at my computer with a cup of coffee, and it's just really, I like it. Um, typically a four minute file takes me about 20 minutes, and a four minute file I make around, mm, probably like four or five dollars. Uh, sometimes not that much, but sometimes it's like 380. It just depends. Like if the person you can't really hear hear them, then it's kind of a harder file to transcribe, and so they'll pay you a little more. And then if if um on go transcription, sorry, go yeah ah okay whatever. I'm gonna just pull up the the files so that I can show you the websites um or. Yeah, on gotranscript.com, I'll show you how it looks because, sorry, so if you can see, this is like how it looks and you can sh choose the jobs and hopefully I'll have to look at this video and make sure, um, but yeah, they have, right now, see, this is why you need to do Babel type too is because right now they only have 16 jobs available. I hopefully that showed you.
Okay, I really hope so because I can't figure out how to work this phone for the life of me. But um, what I was going to say is you need to do, do to do both because um, sometimes uh, Babel type won't have that many files and then sometimes go transcript won't so you, I'd really recommend doing both if you can and then there's also this one I'm applying for it also it's called Scribby and um, I would I would highly recommend it one of my friend does it does it and she makes just off of that one like two two fifty or something so yeah I'd really recommend that I really hope that this video is a blessing to you and I I will link the uh, websites um, for you so that you can start making some extra money and um, these websites uh, pay sorry through PayPal for go uh, sorry not go babble for babble type you do have to fill out a W9 independent contractor uh, tax form um, not with gotranscript.com um, I I don't have to do that so I'm a professional independent contractor with Babel type but not with uh, gotranscript.com I just get paid uh, through PayPal every Saturday each of these jobs they pay once a week so it's not every other week it's once a week with these jobs and um, so what I'm going to do with the Babel type, what I have been doing is I just set aside a certain percentage of the money that I get just so that when we do taxes, I'm, I'm all prepared and, and nothing kind of throws me off. And um, what else was I going to say? Oh, with um, Go Transcript, you, um, so like last week I did not make that much money I only made like 33 with them or something so I created an, an invoice on PayPal for 33 I think it was 67 and then um, my PayPal account it I only got like 31 20 or something 31 dollars and 20 cents just because um, they're based in London and there's a small fee it's really not a huge deal I just transcribe a few more files um, excuse me, just to make up for that small fee. And so, and it's a little bit larger, like if I were to only make, say I only made like $6, it'd only be like a 50 cents fee, but 50 cent fee, but if I made like uh, $200, it'd be like a, you know, $10 fee, just depending on the amount. So yeah, there's not taxes on that one, but there is like a small percentage of a fee. So anyways, I just hope that I helped you. God bless you guys. Um, you know, this is just a way for my husband and I to make some extra cash. And, um, you know, we really like it. I'm a stay-at-home mom. My main and sole role is to be a stay-at-home mom and wife. But I do like being able to have some fun money or just to help my husband. And so talk to your husbands, you know, make sure this is okay. Um, I talked to my husband about it before and, and we decided that it's okay as long as it doesn't interfere with my housework and cooking and all that stuff. So, um, but yeah, thank you and um, have a great day. God bless you guys. I will link the websites below. Okay, bye.